Finally, iOS 18RC is here, but this time we might be disappointed again. Hey guys, this is Tenorshare AI. Apple finally released iOS 18RC, but we still don't have any Apple intelligence features in iOS 18. Those features will be coming at 18.1 in US next month. Other regions may have to wait longer, but I have been using Apple intelligence for a while, and I must say it is very powerful, including photo cleanup and the writing tools. As for Siri 2, I'm a little disappointed. We do have a new UI and type to Siri, but there is no chat GPT. I don't want to wait any longer. So I have found a way to replace Siri with chat GPT 4.0 on any iPhone. In today's video, I will teach you how to do it step by step. Also, I will tell you how to get Apple intelligence in advance. So stick around to the end. If you have watched the Apple September event, you should know that Apple intelligence has device limitation which means that if you don't have an iPhone 15 or 15 Pro or 16, you will not be able to use Siri 2. But if you use the following method, you will be able to integrate chat GPT 4.0 on any iPhone. In fact, the method is very simple. If your iPhone has an action button, you can directly integrate chat GPT 4.0 into the action button. First, we need to go to the App Store and download chat GPT. After that, we go to Settings, Find Action Buttons, then we swipe to the shortcuts feature and click on choose shortcuts. Then just search for chat GPT. As you can see, there is a start voice conversation. Just click this and the chat GPT 4.0 will be integrate to the action button immediately. That's super easy. If your iPhone does not have an action button, like the iPhone 14 I'm holding now, then you need to use the back tap. Just open shortcuts and click on the plus button over here. Next, we need to add a new action and then search for chat GPT and still click on the start voice conversation. Then we have to go to settings, find accessibility, go to touch and then go to back tap. Here we have double tap and triple tap. Choose whichever you want, then just scroll to find the shortcuts we just created. Now we are good to go. Just double tap the back of your iPhone, and then it will start the conversation with chat GPT 4.0. Then how can you get Apple intelligence in advance? You have to upgrade to iOS 18.1 developer beta. After upgrading, we can join the waitlist of Apple intelligence. I recommend you to use Reboot to quickly upgrade or downgrade your device. Reboot offers various iOS packages, including the latest beta versions, allowing us to update our phone effortlessly in just a few minutes. If the beta version feels too buggy, simply back up your data and downgrade back to iOS 18 with Reboot. I will put the link in the description. Just go check it out. So that's all for today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you find this useful. See you next video.